Hey, what is up guys? So today I'm going to be showing you my latest cheap gaming build, which comes out to around 500 to 700 and is an easy solution to getting up and running in 2020. So for this build I sell it on another Dell. Um, workstation hardware tends to be phased out pretty quick and dirt cheap real fast. And this Dell isn't an exception. I purchased a Dell Precision T7810, which came with two Xeon E5620 V3 CPUs, 32 gigs of DDR4 RAM, two 250 gig SSDs, and a NVIDIA NVS520. Sounds expensive, right? This machine came out to a whopping $250. Now with this build, it really just leaves us to buy a decent GPU, such as an RX 580 or even a Radeon 5700 XT. I went with AMD as their prices are usually more budget friendly. The GPU I went with originally was a Sapphire Pulse RX 580, however this card was used for mining and bit the dust pretty quick. For 1080p gaming though, the RX 580 is definitely a good buy with the Pulse, coming out to around $170. It also required no additional power with the Dell's PCIe 6-pin harness, working fine with the 8-pin GPU. To confirm this, I ran Furmark and I had no instability at all. Now for those with a bigger budget, I went with a Sapphire Pulse 5700 XT. This card required a new PCIe harness for the XT as it's an 8 plus 6 pin card, but it worked fine. I encountered no power issues stressing the XT with a max power draw of 200 watts. So uh, I would recommend the 5700 XT as it's a fantastic card and it rivals the 2070 pretty well. Lastly, what you've been waiting for, the benchmarks and gaming performance. To show the full potential of the system, I'm going to be running these benchmarks at 4K, which should give a pretty good idea of how the system performs.
you enjoyed the video, please drop a like and subscribe, and I'll catch you guys in the next one.